Uh, the people who you're going to meet this, this afternoon deserve these awards. The heart of broadcast journalism, of course, is the investigative report, which results in swift corrective action. This goal is perfectly realized in this series of reports from National Public Radio. According to these lists, cigarettes contain ingredients so toxic that you could not dump them in a landfill under the federal environmental laws. National Public Radio has learned the names of 13 chemicals on the secret list that was submitted to the government in December of 1992. This is the list that government health officials are still working with today. Out of the more than 700 substances on the list, these 13 are the ones that the Food and Drug Administration doesn't allow to be used in foods. Cigarette makers can use them because cigarettes are not subject to FDA regulations. Here to accept is Mr. Richard Harris, reporter. Thank you very much. This is a great honor. Uh, the voice you heard was my fellow reporter, Rebecca Pearl. And when she decided to apply for a fellowship last year, she thought, well, maybe the subject of tobacco would be a nice sleepy backwater and she could relax a little bit. Uh, she discovered just how wrong she was. And uh, she could not be here today because she just gave birth last week to a seven pound boy. And no, she did not name him Philip, Morris, or Kent. <laughs> We would like to thank science editors Ann Gudenkoff and Rob Stein and Rebecca's producer Gary Cavino and of course the Peabody Advisory Board for honoring our work. Thank you.